to the second part of testing the gray scotch bright pad. If you haven't watched the first video, I have a link of it in the description below, or you can watch it over here. Now, on that one we, we, we did average pressure on the ball. On this one we're going to crank up the pressure and hit the ball as, with a lot of more force. So we can see if there's any difference in the performance of the material. Now we scanned this ball before on the previous video, it's the same ball, but uh, since we're doing we're trying to do it scientifically, I'm going to always scan the ball before and after each test. Okay, so let's start. As you can see, that's 15100. And I'm going to scan on a different area, of course. So we can be sure that the board is properly surfaced. And this one is almost exactly 5,000. Okay, lots of pressure. Gonna be around 30 seconds again, moving the sides of the ball a little bit on the top and then again the sides. Now I'm trying to do these tests as a single cut. So this way they can be more authentic and more truthful. So you have to put up with my my English and my accent. Okay, the other half. some pressure here. Okay. I didn't notice much cutting, but that's why we have the scanner. And again, we're using the same two areas that we scanned before. Now we had 5100 on this area. Let's see what we got. Okay, now it's 4,961. So that's a little bit of a difference. A little bit. Now let's check the other side. 
that we stand before you. And that sign was exactly 5,000. Okay, this one is 4,813. So, a little bit over here as well. So, what is the, what is the takeaway? What is the XP points that we get out of this video? If we have a shiny ball, around 5,000, and we try to hit it with a gray, Scotch bright pad, even by using a lot of force, it doesn't really cut much. Now, if you, you as you saw, it, it cut about 100, it had around 100 difference in the grid surface. From 5,100, it went to around 5,000, and from 5,000 to around 4,800, 4,850. So it was about 100 to 150 degree. So don't expect anything more than this one. And uh, I don't know if uh, the the starting surface was different, if this pad could actually do something. But at least in this in the shiny ball, it will not. So if you like this video, please subscribe, like, hit the bell button, or or you can support me via Patreon. I uh, hope to see you on the next video, which is going to be the green uh, Scotch Pride pad, which is supposed to be 600 uh, grit, and I I, th I suppose it will have a very different uh, performance than this one. That's it for today, and thanks for watching.